where you are but they don't know where you come from your neighbor is sick where you are but they don't know where you come from you come from a rich family because you are born of God what is born of God overcomes the world. You are an overcomer. Your father was defeated, but you can't be defeated. Your mother was defeated, but you can't be defeated because you are not born of your mother and father. You are born of God. Lamb of God that is seated from the right hand of the Father, you are whole. Holy you are holy. You are holy. You are whole. Holy you are holy. You are holy.
Shekha. The Lord is going to use you. The Lord is going to change your life. He has not forgotten about you. Your life will become the story that is great in your family. And many will say, surely this can only be God. So this is a season of loving God. Continue to love Him. He's going to do great things in your life. There is a scepter of the King upon your head. Shanta Sota Rababa. Lift your hands to the King. Lift your hands to the King that is living forever. Thank you Holy Ghost. Thank you Spirit of the Father. Thank you Holy Spirit. You are holy, Heavenly Father. You are holy, mighty God. You are holy, King of Kings. Holy Lord of Lords. Santa Bosheka Bahaya. Holy Lord, thank you. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Holy Ghost. In the name of Yeshua. Covenant keeping God. There is no one like you. Alpha and Omega. There is no one like you. Covenant keeping God, there is no one like you. I'll find Omega, there is no one like you. You're the covenant, covenant keeping God, there is no one like you. change in the speed of your life. That from a season when it thinks that it looks like nothing is working, all doors are just closing before you. When you begin to lose everything, that you begin to find yourself in a position where you don't know where to go and where to turn. But the Lord says, I have not forgotten about the promise I've made for you. For in you there is an entrepreneur you there is a spirit that is coming that will make you enter into the marketplace where the Lord says you have tried all you can but nothing has worked before but after tonight the Lord is going to open up the door for you and what has been a stronghold in your family the Lord is going to break you and the Lord is going to stabilize your life and things will change for the better see a land. The Lord said, I will give you the land. And not only I will give you the land. The Lord says, you will become the farmer that I have promised to you. And there will be agriculture that will come out of you. As you begin to deal with food and order, the Lord says, I will make you great as I promised. And what happened to your father will not happen to you, says the Spirit of the Lord. Thank you, Holy Spirit. There is no the Lord will keep you. The Lord will keep you. A little lower. The, the Lord will keep you. Because the Lord loves you. The enemy 
enemy has been trying to kill you. He's been looking for your life. And see as if like a spirit even of an accident has been following you. A spirit of accident. But the Lord says to me that I should tell you that what the enemy meant for evil, the Lord is about to make it work together for your good. Because not only the Lord will keep your life, and he will preserve you from those who seek to eat your blood. But the Lord will change every situation to do with work. Whatever conspiracy that has happened against you to do with whatever work that you do. But the Lord says to me that no sabotage will happen against you. And the Lord says I will vindicate you and I will promote you in this season by giving you exactly that which I said I will give to you. But the Lord says you've been trusting him even for a house that I see. I see you are trusting God for a house. And the Lord says it's been a struggle after struggle. Rejection even by the banks. But the Lord says to me that in this season you found yourself entangled even financially strained because of the debts that you are having right now. But the Lord is saying to me that this is a season where the Lord is about to break the yoke over your life and is opening up the doors that have been strained over you. And after today, prosperity begins to follow you. And you will not die. You will live to declare the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. In the name of Jesus. Is it true? Is it true? Amen. Uh, 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 just testify. Is it true? Amen. It's true. Uh, what I'm saying to you, do you know what I'm saying? Amen. It's true. Is, uh, you know what I'm saying? Yes, prophet. Oh, okay, okay. So that it, 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 the faith of the of the others, they want to hear you say, it's true. Hallelujah. It is true. In Zimbabwe, they say, it's true. Amen. Amen. It means it's the truth. Hallelujah. Amen. Um, who's from Zimbabwe here? Is there anyone from Zimbabwe? You're from Zimbabwe. So, so you know each one. It is the truth. Hallelujah. So God has spoken over you. And your life will never be the same. Remember a prophecy for one is a prophecy for all. You are changing from today. Your life.